Oh, look who's here. It's a cute little kitten who lives in a tree. Time for a ride in your basket. Cue the balloons. Ah, flying. It's the only way to travel. The tree kitten has landed. Now let's bundle you up like a little burrito. Let's clean you up. We should start with those ears. This calls for heavy duty stuff. Good thing we've got a fingertip toothbrush. Really get in those whiskers and scrub those messy paws. Almost done. You can dry off and cosplay as a bunny at the same time. <laughs> Meanwhile, we've got a special surprise for you. Huh? Put some holes in this milk carton and add some udders on top. Now it's like he's got his own personal cow. But around here, we go all out for snack time. We've got food, we've got water, we've got buttons, and the pièce de résistance, the meat bar. Of course, you might be in the mood for sausages. Who said cats don't like dogs, especially hot dogs? Now it's time to have some fun with this long tunnel. Add them to some cardboard boxes. Now our tree kitten has his very own tunnel system. After all, why should hamsters have all the fun? Let's add a little personalization while we're at it. There's no doubt what furry friend lives here. Anyone in the mood for tiny billiards? He'll write the great kitty novel on this. What else? Here's an idea. Grab an old t-shirt. Tie up the ends and hang it up. It's a kitty hammock. Throw on some pillows. Now grab a rubber glove. You only need one. Add it around a cup and fill it up with sand. It's great if you want a tiny chair or a moderate sized hand. Add a reminder of his favorite person and it's time to explore. I told you he liked her. He plays pool by his own rules. Ah, such a bright sunny day for napping. Hey, be careful on top of that. Even if you can land on your feet. Let's have fun with these paw prints. Add epoxy resin. Decorate any way you want and then add them on a chain. It's a friendship bracelet. Well, a necklace at his size. I've heard of a monkey on your shoulder, but this is better. Run some string through a shower glove's fingertips. Our kitty's not the only one with retractable claws. Now we need to blow up a balloon. Well, that works. Make four of these and tie to each of the strings. It's like a baby mobile and a cat toy rolled in one. Cut up some foam around and cardboard. It's a tiny sink, complete with a tiny mirror. We can even cut up a straw to make a faucet. Add a dial. And what's a bathroom without a bath? A uh, gesundheit. Uh -oh. Is that rain tinsel? How'd that get up there? Hmm, 
This tub could use some tinsel and pom-poms. <laughs> After all, cats don't really do water. What the? I don't think your dolls will miss this garland. Time to see if our kitten likes his new water closet. Probably should powder his nose while we're here. Next up, take a sock and put it on a glass. Fill it up with some soil and seeds. And then, some more soil. We'll need to speed things up a bit. Wrap it up and add googly eyes. Why not? Now that you know how to make it, you'll never run out of delicious cat grass. This cat house needs a doorway. Now take the bristles off some toothbrushes and add it to the door. Grooming now just takes a few steps. Time to get out an old plastic bottle. Cut off the end. Now add some hot glue in the middle. Reattach with some string and pull out the neck. Now take a ball and attach with some more hot glue. Just pull it down and it pops open. Now add kibble. And behold, your cat can have treats with the flick of a paw. Why not make one for yourself while you're at it? It's the best of both worlds. Your kitty gets a ball to play with and snacks. Mmm, chips. Eh, never mind, at least we got the two. Tie some jute rope around it. Lasso it up. Add a bunch to the side of one of the boxes. Now your little rock climber can get some exercise. It's also a fun way of going up without stairs. And it's the perfect place for just hanging around. This cute tiny candy ball's the perfect thing for our cute tiny cat. Got something in your throat? Ooh, a fish skeleton. Dip it in some paint and decorate the cat's house. That, or just make some fish bone broth. Seaweed in her hair? What, is she a mermaid? Well, it's fish related, so on the box it goes. So tell me, kitty, do you like your new pad? You can just relax and scratch an itch, or go on a little adventure. After all, you're the king of this castle. Who Today's the big day. It's Kitty's birthday. You're gonna need a birthday cake. Just one suited to a more feline palette. Still, all the best cakes have sprinkles. And a birthday candle to blow out. Happy birthday! Make a wish, kitty! Open your present! It's a Roblox doll! Um, I think we need to clean her up. At least she'll smell minty fresh. We'll say it's that new peppermint perfume. Now let's turn her frown upside down. Some clothes and hair should help too. Now cover her legs with the glove and tie up all those loose fingers. Pour on some glue, spread it out, and it's time for glitter. Keep it coming. Our little mermaid could use a dip in the pool. It's Kitty's favorite vowels. 
Oh, no! At least we still got I, O, and U. Hmm. But maybe we can fix them up. Now let the magic potty do its thing. Oh, they've never been closer. Keep them on the ground this time. Time for a guessing game. Pick one. Oh, you want a unicorn. A candy unicorn. Just feed it some melted chocolate. And soon, you get a few surprises. Cute little bite-sized pieces of candy. Ooh, you got a fish. So grab an old Barbie bed. And with a few adjustments, it's a new tank. Of course, we can't forget the water. What else is our fish gonna swim in? And look, these fish come in a pair. Love is in the air. Uh, water. Look, a sand ducky. Oh, now it's just sand. How would you like a marshmallow ducky instead? They go great in a cup of hot cocoa. Especially when it's all blue like this. Look at all the candy. You hit the Whoa. jackpot. Oh no, your lollipop. It's okay, we've got more. And this time, we'll be ready. Our new tiger friends got your back. And, more importantly, your candy. Next, it's your favorite, toothpicks. So, anyone up for a 52 pickup? But next time, let's keep them in here. Now, when you need a new toothpick, our new bird friend can pick it up for you. And you can go back to making stick houses. Wow, look at all those bubbles! But we're just getting things started. It's a bubble machine. Press play and watch it go. I think Kitty's a fan. And he's not the only one. Look who's here. It's Jimmy the pig. Hmm, he doesn't look too good. Don't worry, we can fix him up. Oh, wait a minute. I see the problem. He's got a smaller pig inside him. Looks like he's got something inside him, too. It's a tiny gray mouse. The gifts just keep coming. Speaking of which, you got a new dumpling maker. Knead the dough and don't forget your favorite filling. We can make as many as we want. And we can even try out a few new flavors. Yeah, he prefers sweet to savory. Just make sure you pick the right one. Now let's make Kitty a brand new friend. And I think he'll be a good influence. 
Unless, of course, Kitty gets to him first. Of course, Kitty can always make his own friends. Let the soap harden. Flip it over. And help our new friend put his face on. Aw, what a bright little guy. Look, you got a card. And it's got money. With all this cash, it'll be like your birthdays every day. After all, think of all the crafts we can do with them. Cut out a bunch of hearts and fold them all together. Make it into a circle and it's a brand new toy. Fun like this is truly priceless. Look, Kitty, a cup with all your favorite letters. Not impressed? How about we take some foil? Add some clay. And add a few finishing touches. Look who's here, our old pal A. Aw, they're already best friends. Ooh, berries! Hey, don't play with your food. And keep your paws to yourself. Ugh, what a mess. Next time, just use the micro mixer. All you do is push a button. And there's no mess to worry about. Let's pour this mix into a bowl for our kitty cat friend to enjoy. Ooh, a balloon! Careful, your claws! Well, at least we still got the duck. Hmm, maybe we can still use the balloon. Drop a surprise inside. And a whole lot of water. Freeze it, and it'll survive any cat scratch fever. Of course, Kitty still wants the prize inside. I think there's time for one last present. It's a mini projector! Just put it together. Dim the lights. And Kitty's the star of the show. just caught a fish. He's gonna need a place to stay. It could use a little decor. Some personal touches. Oh, and water. Our fishy's got a new forever home. 
If you're wondering why Kitty's practicing taking care of others, she's having oh. kittens. She's gonna be a mommy. <laughs> Careful, the bugs are out. And some stings. Don't cry. This pump should help. And that's not all. Get the full lips you always wanted. Those duck lips are the cat's meow. Uh-oh. She's gonna need some TP. I don't think those are gonna cut it. A cat figurine? Well, grab a pop tube. And it could be the perfect TP holder. Wow, this cat's on a roll. Or is it the other way around? Of course, cats prefer the litter box. After all, it doubles as a sandbox. Add some glue and beads. And those paw prints will last forever. It's important to hydrate. But this special cup needs a special straw. Two grimaces, but they're all smiles. And look, he even plays peekaboo. Well, that's one way to split a hot dog. It's okay. She's got a backup lunch. With a plastic bag cover, you can even cook ramen on a book. And if you keep the book close, you can have a private picnic. Oh, berries don't get any fresher than this. Uh-oh, let's clean those braces. Our little green friend should help. Now squirt out some toothpaste. An electric brush does the work for you. Especially when your cat lends a paw. Guess even cats need to eat on the go. Hmm, does someone want another cat? But our little cat mama can help you make friends. Make a mask. Now grab a toilet paper roll. And place it on the back. Now we need some finishing kitty touches. Those eyes! It's like one of those clocks! Well, minus the clock. <laughs> Fall is in the air. Make that hair! Hey, if you want to play with hair, you should give this guy a try. He can grow as much as you want him to. And then, you can cut it down the size. Ooh, did you cut off too much? Well, nothing a few extensions can't fix. Wait till we get some mustaches. Get 
guess not every puss likes to wear boots. Here's an idea. Take some water. Spray in some aerosol paint. And give those booties a dip. Ooh, they're rainbow colored. With little kitties on top. Hey, watch your step! After all, you're not the only one with dirty paws. Actually, that gives me an idea. We can spray on some color over shapes. You get a cool design. And it covers stains with the power of a rainbow. Oh, but we're not done just yet. Oh, what a cute family album. Wait, how'd that get in there? Let's rethink this album. Grab some ice cream sticks. And make a Ferris wheel. Now the pictures will go around and around and around and around. And you can even spin the wheel. <laughs> Poor kitty. And she's not the only one. Don't worry. You're coming with us. Just gotta sneak past mom and done. Now let's make some space for you. You'll have the closet all to yourself. But it can still use some customization. Why don't we make an opening? To make you your own kitty door. And with some toothbrush bristles. It's great for a quick brush. <laughs> now let's roll out the carpets. Huh? <laughs> and this remote car <laughs> can be a five-star delivery service. <laughs> and a plastic hey. bottle's great for holding dry food. Put it somewhere your cat can get it. In case it wants a midnight snack. Next up, we're gonna need some hair. Barring that, string or rope is fine. Either way, wrap it around a plastic pipe. Yeah. <laughs> oh, but where to put it? Oh, make a hole. Put it through and add more pipes. Soon you'll have a massive scratching post. And we can decorate with our favorite plush toys. Always great to lend a hand or two. Yeah, woohoo! Huh? With cats, Toilets are basically drinking fountains. So let's make sure it's got clean water. Now grab a pop tube and roll on some paper. After all, every toilet needs TP. Hey, where'd all this cotton come from? Don't worry, we can fix him. But we can make him even better. By filling him up with treats.
Look how easy it is to dispense. And with a few adjustments, <laughs> it's also a seat. Hmm? Ooh, candy. Huh? Ooh, slime. Two great things, just not together. So let's add catnip instead. Our little friend here will hold it. While your cat takes a few licks. Ooh. Wow, what an amazing toy! Plop a little ball inside. And you can fold it into new shapes. Even with the ball still inside. Ooh, there's a bulb on the fritz. Well, we can still use the empty glass. Ditch the wire and fill with water. Add some cardboard and a phone. And you've got yourself a new video projector. Guess we can spare this plushie, <laughs> now that we've got the real thing. Drill some holes. Add cat-friendly seeds and water. <laughs> this toy's got a brand new do. And your cat gets a quick nibble. Next, slice up a big plastic bottle. Add some twine on the sides to make handles. And add something soft. Hang up a tiny kitty hammock with a special surprise inside. Ooh, where'd that red dot come from? I think it wants to show us something. Wow, a cat treat gadget. Let's take it for a spin. Look, it's cat treats all around. For your cat, it's dinner and a show. What the? Ugh, how'd a bug get in here? Hmm. It's okay. Take some cardboard. And we can make some kitty cubbies. It'll keep your cat's favorite things safe. Which, naturally, are mostly just food. Just make sure to close it up. Of course, cats are also partial to balls of yarn. So lay down some yarn, hot glue some sticks, and lay them down like a bridge. Hook it up. Let's test it out. Now that's what I call sturdy. Oh. Mmm, sushi. Let's make our own. Yeah. Black for seaweed, white for rice, and yellow for egg. And add your favorite fillings. Now roll it up and start slicing. <laughs> but it's not for eating, it's for hanging up. <laughs> Huh? Hey, how'd that get in there? Well, we can use it to attach these pipes. Once it's secure, we can hook it up, too. Ooh, look at that hair. Oh, inspiration strikes. Let's add color. 
and make a bunch. It can give the lamp the cozy cover it needs. Just add some finishing touches and our cat closet's almost ready. It's time for our new feline friend to explore their new pad. You must be this cute to go through. Careful now, there's a detour. Oh, there's so many things to play with. And even fun things to eat. Hey, being cute is thirsty work. This sushi sure looks like fun. Let's take a look on top. Ooh, a ball. Try to catch it. Look, a well-stocked pantry. And plenty of plants to nibble on. After all that fun, it's time for a nap. But the best part about a closet uh -huh. Uh -huh. is that it's great for hiding stuff. <laughs> also helps if your cat's a magician. Uh -huh. <laughs> ah, cats. It's their uh -huh. world. We're just living in it. But when it comes to cats and cat ladies, uh -huh. love always finds a way. I won't tell dad if you won't. Wait till you see the best part. This cat already comes with kittens. Now let's clean you up with our very own cat tongue. Soon you'll do this for the kittens. Actually, I think both of them will. Ooh, someone needs a bath. Now let's put on your shower cap. Oh, right, cats don't like water. That's why we've got a special cleaning kit. Add a little foam and comb it into the fur. Now your cat smells brand new. It's time for a little redecorating. Careful, you don't want to lose such precious dirt. Let's sweep it all into a corner. Make sure to spread it out. Grab a rubber chicken or other garden tools. We're gonna plant some seeds. Don't forget to water, and pretty soon, you'll have your very own grass carpet. <laughs> now grab some cardboard and add them to the sides. Now, we'll need a bowl. An empty one. Use it to draw a circle. And cut it out. Wow. And the bowl should fit right in. Let's make a bunch of these little windows. Hey, do we need to clean the cat again? No, it's coming from this old pizza box. Ditch the pizza, but let's keep the box. In fact, a bunch of these boxes will help us make a kitty bathroom. 
complete with all the amenities. Think outside the litter box. Hey, I think she likes it. But first, it's petting time. Who's a good girl? If only we had some room to move. Here's an idea. Let's distract the cat. Grab a bunch of different pillows. And make yourself a decoy you. See, kitty? An even softer lap. And we're free to go explore. Just in time. I think I just heard something inside your closet. Ooh, the dolls are having a party. Complete with a little mini fridge. Now we can fill it up with all of our cat's favorite feasts. Well, when Dad's away, the cat will play. Okay, a typing cat is impressive. But Dad's not supposed to see you. So let's get you out of here. Still, if you like computers so much, we'll make one just for you. One that's also a scratching post. And it's so fun to sit on. Oh, hey, what you looking at? Ooh, birds. I wish we had our own bird. And now we do, a rainbow parrot. It can fly too. Eh, everyone's a critic. Well, at least we still like it. But you know what else is fun? A great big cardboard box. Thanks. Let's tear it apart and put it back together, but in a whole new way. Otherwise, it'd just be busy work. Don't forget to close up the back. It looks like a television set. Let's put on the mouse network. Talk about interactive television. But in life, cats are the stars, and we are just the spectators. Uh-oh. Dad needs new glasses. But let's hope he keeps them for now. Oh, and by the way, happy birthday! He's got a special surprise for you. It's a new cat. Well, a toy one. Because you don't have a real one. And to keep him thinking that, let's put this fur remover to good use. And he's none the wiser. Wait, where's the cat? Uh-oh, she's on the prowl. And she's on a feng shui kick. Hmm, let's get something that'll keep her distracted. Like this fun whack-a-mouse gadget. And the best part, no tokens required. Let's hope she washed her paws first. Quick, grab it! 
Or at least turn it over. As for Dad, who wants pizza? And how about we fill up all these paw prints? Give it time to dry and flip it over. And it fits right on your cat's collar. Gimme paw! It's the gift that keeps on giving. Mm -hmm. Next up, we're gonna need a sock. Now add to a glass container and fill with dirt. Add some seeds, cover with more dirt, and tie up that sock like peas in a pod. Let's add some cute little antennae. Spray on water. Watch the plants grow. And give your cat a new treat. It wiggles, too. Wow, this place is really coming together. <laughs> it's where all the cool cats want to be. And what Dad doesn't know won't hurt him. Of course, even with all the fun stuff we've made, Sometimes, all you need is a place for a little cat nap. Ooh, I choose you, Pikachu. Hey, isn't he a mouse Pokemon? Uh-oh, but it's all right. We can fix him. Just add some parts to an old tube. Ooh. Pikachu's gotten taller. Now wrap some rope around the tube. And don't forget his other parts. He's like a brand new scratching post. And I think he's ready for a new play date. Aw, now play nice, you two. What do we have here? A wood wow. stick. Now let's add it to a wooden square. A nice hinge will keep it in place. <laughs> Gotta keep it nice and secure. But now, we're gonna add some layers. Mm -hmm. Like a nice midsection. And now for the top floor. Hmm, it's a little hard. Let's get something soft. <laughs> like a bunch of pillows. Oh, look, they fit right in. What else can we use? Ah, curtains. Now let's make some cuts. and tie it around the structure. Wow. Pretty soon, you've got a new canopy bed. Ah, this cat tree looks like a lot of fun. Ah, please tell me that's just juice. Ew. Well, that sock's seen better days. Ew. Hmm. That mini toilet could be useful. Let's fill it up with kitty litter. And let our feline friend try it out. Well, I'll get the scoop. Hey, what's under here? Books! This'll come in handy as our new cat staircase. Of course, cats always land on their feet. Ooh, the cookies are burning. 
And while she's not looking, Luna's in the mood for chicken. Hmm, let's get you some lunch. Smear some food on this licking mat. That takes care of Kitty. So, who wants pizza? Oh no! That's your second favorite plant! Good catch! Here's an idea. Collect some old feathers. And add them to your shoes. Now you can keep an eye on Luna's playtime. It's time to start another day. Oh, can we borrow this towel? All we need is a little rope belt. Wow, everyone's so generous today. Add it inside. Make twists and turns. And you've got a tiny hammock. All that's left is to hang it up. Let's make one for the cat, too. Time for a well-deserved snack. Uh-oh, that's gonna leave a stain. I guess we could just cover it up. Looks like the cat got to it first. We could just do the laundry. But this fur remover should do the trick. Now it's as good as new. Uh-oh! Oh, what is it with this cat and plants? It's okay. Add a sock to a glass. Fill it up with seeds and soil. Water it, and soon it'll grow. Wow, that was quick. Wow! Add some eyes. And now, it's your cat's new best friend. Or snack. Either way, this cat prefers food with a face. Aw, makes you wish you had a feline friend. Nothing a little scrolling can't fix. Time to take out the trash. Meow? Ooh, a kitty. Let's take you home. Just remember, we should probably keep this a secret from Mom. Yeah, she's not exactly a cat person. Speaking of cats, where is she? Better find her before Mom. Hey! We need to kitty-proof this room. Cut out a hole in the table. Now grab a glass bowl. We're making a giant fish tank. Complete with underwater flora. Of course, for anything to be underwater, you're gonna need some water. Now, grab some pieces of cardboard and use them to cover the sides of the table. Hmm, what else can we use? Like a handy dandy fish sponge. Take some scissors and cut it up into a nice arc shape. 
Now dip in some paint and get stamping. Pretty soon, it'll look like fish scales. <laughs> now let's shine a light on things with our mini lamp. In fact, let's add a bunch. Next up, let's grab some old curtains. Lay it down and cut a hole. Now lay down some turtles. And hang them right under the lights. It's a perfect sight for you and Kitty to enjoy. Hey, don't you want your snack? Cut out a paper plate rim and hang it up. Give it a watery touch and add some treats. Don't forget, cats need their greens too. Besides, cats really dig them. Why don't we collect it all? Soil is a terrible thing to waste. Seeds have to go somewhere. Don't forget to water them. It's your cat's very own snack corner. Wait, what's your cat up to now? I think she needs a bed. We'll need something soft, too. Ooh, a towel. I'm sure she's not going to need it. Now let's lay it down and roll it up. And fold it into a circle. Now take some tape and cover it up. Until it looks like a giant lifesaver. It still needs something soft inside. Perfect, a soft shirt, just in time too. Cause someone needs a cat nap. Oh, ouch! Look, it's seashells. The perfect thing for decorating. Like this clear plastic container. This could use a line of pearls around the rim, too. It's a treasure chest with undersea camouflage. Fill it with sand. Grab a shovel. And it's a brand new litter box. Next up, grab a plastic bottle. And attach a string with beads. Hold it up. It's a nice jellyfish. It'll be your cat's new favorite toy. Just hang it up within reach. Wow, it's snowing. Inside? Wait. It's caught. Where is it coming from? Uh-oh. She's got a cat scratch fever. We gotta fix this. Grab some tubes. And spin some twine around them. Now poke some holes in the lid. And add some feathers inside. It's your brand new palm tree scratching post. Anyone else in a crafting mood? Well, go to the kitchen for some pasta. 
I know it's fun to try new recipes. But maybe you should order some pizza. Now, take the pasta and hot glue them to the pieces of cardboard. Now let's paint these shell clusters. And soon, we've got a coral garden. Let's show them off by adding them to our new cat water fountain. Wow. <laughs> Not thirsty? Well, maybe you're hungry. <laughs> Guess it's all in the presentation. Take the kibble piece by piece and form it up into a new shape. <laughs> like a cute little turtle. He's crunchy. But he's got a soft shell deep down. Look, it's a whole family. Then again, I can see your cats clearly just eat. Well, it's not gonna scoop itself. Ooh, what a cute little paw print. Careful now, add some shells inside. And use a glue gun to save the shape. Aw, it's just what our kitty collar needs. Now cover your aquarium with tulle fabric. Complete with a fishnet design. Add some cute little seashell fish too. Wow. <laughs> Come on, kitty. It's time for the grand opening. There's things to play with and places to sleep. Let's see how you look in a fishbowl. Wow, you can almost be a fish. Let's hope mom thinks so too. Uh-oh, she's got her glasses on. And I think she wants a closer look. The cat's out of the bag, but it's okay. I think she's a kitty convert. This cinema takes security seriously. Uh-oh. Sorry, ma'am. No dogs allowed. But she's got some tricks up her sleeve. Mmm, chili, sir? Huh? Well, enjoy the movie. Still, let's keep an eye on things. A werewolf! Wait, no, she snuck her dog in. What a good boy. You deserve a treat. Hey, leave some popcorn for the rest of us. Come on, the camera loves you! You own that catwalk! Though, maybe I shouldn't have used the word catwalk? Want your pup to be a fashion star? Start with boots! Let's try these first. Aren't they cute? Perfect fit! Just remember, we need four in all! It's not like your pup can resist all those puddles! Now let's try the balloon. Deflate it a little. That was quick. Now place on your puffer. And it still protects their paws from all that dirt. Either way, it's cheaper than a doggy treadmill. Of course, while dogs appreciate a good walk, they sometimes prefer to just ride along. 
Especially when you do the <laughs> skating for them. Hey, look, Ma! No paws! But if you don't have a special bag... We can try out an old tote bag. Cut out some paw holes. Plop your puppy right inside and go for a spin. Just be careful if you've got a great dame. Time for gadgets for your dog's more private moments. This one's pretty big. And look, it gets bigger. And bags are included. Just take one and wrap it around. Well, we might as well try it out. Give it a sec and test it out. That was easy. Oh, guess I spoke too soon. What are you feeding him? Let's just hope we don't run out of bags. Now let's try the hair clip. Hope you don't use it. Either way, we're covering it up. Hey, it works! And good thing the trash bin's right here. Well, that was fun. But now, here's something for the cats. Look at that cat brush. And those bristles. And while we've got a cat here, why not try it out? Look at all that hair! Well, now it's a toupee. Up next, we're gonna try a foot. Oh, I guess just the sock. Add onto a brush. Just make sure all those bristles poke through. Groomed twice in one day? <laughs> this cat knows how to live. Pull off the sock and the mess is gone. Pets don't do that whole don't play with your food thing. Take this toy garden. Bury some treats. Plop in some carrots. Sort of reverse gardening, you know? Like, come on, Scoob! Put that snout to work! After all, what dog doesn't like to dig? Eh, carrots are really more of a rabbit thing. Take a TP roll, cover the bottom. Put a string through it and add a few more. Fill up with treats and give to your dog. The trick is to spin them around. It gets them on the floor, but not for long. Dogs gotta keep up their tongue exercises. Wow, look at all those suction cups. Stick it up and spread on something yummy for your pooch. While they're not looking, it's grooming time. Here's our backup plan. Take some plastic wrap. Wrap around your head and add the food. Now you and your dog can have some quality time. So why not squeeze in a manicure? Can't neglect your pet's dental care. And just in time, let's start with a brush. Now let's use the glove, but it could use some help. You just can't beat a good bristle. Add some doggy safe toothpaste. Now when you brush, really get in there. Ah, cats just seem to get the best toys. Just add a plume on top of this toy.
Now, let your cat take it for a spin. So many ways you can play with it. This kitty's gonna sleep well tonight. But why not make a toy? Hey, watch out! Look, a feather! <laughs> this could come in handy. Just tape it to the end of your shoe. Why not both slippers while you're at it? Now you and your cat can play together. Throw in some catnip, and this is kitty luxury. Now for a puppy bumper. Start with the donut. After all, who doesn't love donuts? Open up and stick your pup inside. Now that fence is nothing to worry about. Now try a spoon. Just add to a harness. Like a cone of shame, but without the shame. Pets sometimes need a little space. You know, a little alone time. <laughs> this cute little tent is just the thing. Of course, there's some owner assembly required. Come on, kitty, there's plenty of room inside. No wonder female cats are called queens. Let's see what we can make out of these old jeans. Plenty of leg room, but let's add some stuffing. Now fold it up into a makeshift lap. And it's your cat's rightful throne. It's time for some interactive dog toys. This bone's got some teeth. Add kibble. Let's hope its bark is worse than its bite. Now for the ultimate test. The bone or the chicken? Uh-huh, dogs and bones just go together. If you don't have one, just take a towel. Add some kibble in a pattern and fold it up. Nothing can hide from a dog's trusty sniffer. Unroll the pink carpet. It's snack time. Puppies are cute, but they usually don't come housebroken. Devices like this should help. Just add a sheet. And your dog enjoys their own patch of lawn. But maybe a nice plastic bin is all you need. Just fill it up with some sand. Maybe some rocks and wood shavings too. Now roll out a patch of artificial grass. Stick it in a corner and let your puppy enjoy needing to go. Cats just love a good light show. What are you waiting for? Fire the laser! If only the laser wasn't so hard to catch. Just like one of those cartoon mice. But maybe all we need is a hard hat. With a laser pen taped onto the front. Shake your head. Just don't get dizzy. I mean, you could just use the laser pen by hand. But come on, where's the fun in that? Because selfies aren't just for people. Seriously, social media is 99% pet photos. For this device, clip on a snack and a phone. 
Come on, time to get ready for your close-up. Let's send these headshots to Paw Patrol. This frame might help too. Smear it with food. Once again, the food will catch your dog's attention. Zoom in, unless you want the food in the photo. Of course, it's hard to take a bad photo with such a cute model. Pet amazing stuff. Catch you next time. Wait, Jeeves, do you see what I see? There's a dog in a basket, in the water. Oh, we gotta save him. And by we, I mean you, Jeeves. I'll whip up my very own doggy pocket. I'll call you Seiko. Let's go to your new home. Aw, who's a good girl? Ugh, with bad breath. What you need is this finger toothbrush. Add some toothpaste. And start brushing. Good girl. I accept payment in puppy kisses. Well, aren't we feeling jumpy today? Here, this should calm you down. Now for some relaxing oils. And a nice face roller massage. Next up, a gua sha scraper. It'll take care of any muscle pain. And who can say no to a manicure? Plus a nice soothing paw rub. A face mask? I guess it fits. And while you relax, we'll get lunch ready. You know, it helps to chew your food. Looks like you could use a challenge. Like this dog puzzle. We'll need to hide some treats inside. Okay, come on down. You're the next contestant on The Treat is Right. You win a snack. And another. And you take your time enjoying them. Finally, it's okay to play with your food. Wow, sand bottles. Squish them up. And it's like a day at the beach. It's also great for making paw prints. And if you want to make it last, fill it up with tiny treasures. Glitter. And pour on some epoxy resin. Pretty soon, you'll have something sparkly for your dog to wear. I love you too, but just let me finish my nails. Okay, we need a distraction. Ooh, a rubber glove. Now fill it up with liquid and seal it up. Make a bunch and place on your pup for some hands-free petting. can get back to... Oh no! Looks like someone's been shedding! Don't worry, our lint rollerball will save the day. Works great on sleeves, so let's try the couch. Now everything looks store-bought new. Mm -hmm. Aww, 
He's sharing his toys with you. He must like you. Or he's just playing fetch. Extreme edition. We need something to hold them all. Like this inflatable pool. There's plenty of room inside for everyone. Careful, you'll tire yourself out. Or is that the idea? Well, as they say, <laughs> let sleeping dogs lie. It's getting late. Almost time for bed. Which reminds me, he needs a bed. First, let's get him off the floor. Get a laundry basket and some cut-up pool noodles. Lay them inside and add a blanket. And the final touch, a cute puppy. Oh, don't forget the bedtime story. Once upon a time, and they lived happily ever after. Hmm. 40 winks wouldn't be so bad. It's still early, so let's keep quiet. Never mind, but hey, free planks. Always fun to squeeze in a little woodworking. Especially when making a dog house. Seiko's gonna need a nameplate. And a potato? Ooh, a potato stamp. Dip it into some paint. And decorate the doghouse. Everybody raise a paw. Next, add some push pins to the sides. Tie some string around them, and you can make letters. D O G. Come on, Seiko. Oh, I think she likes it. Whoops. Yeah, I'd say goodbye to that shoe. You know, if you got any old pumps, grab some pipes. Add them together into a cube. And hang the old shoes on top. You know, Seiko's right. Shoes are fun. Hang some rope on the other side. We're making a puppy playground. Catch the ball, Seiko! Wow! Three for one! Oh, let's hang these up, too! And that's just the start! Come on, Seiko! Let's try it out! Now for the shoes! Ha! Huh, Seiko's gonna sleep good tonight! Oh, it's hot! Oh no! Seiko! You're panting! And dogs can't sweat! Well, mm, paw pads. Jeeves! Oh, a duvet cover? Lie it down on the ground. Now place a fan on its side. And blow it up nice and big. It's the coolest spot around, literally. Time to make some art. Ooh, Seiko wants to help. Hmm, it's not such a bad look. So why don't we make more paw prints? Scan them and hang them up at your house. he 
he'll always know he's home. Yeah, I think Seiko's gonna like it here. But sometimes, all a dog really needs is just a nice new tennis ball. Not that all his new toys aren't cool. Ah, who am I kidding? New stuff's great! Hey Mario, are you ready for a new adventure? Let's -a go! A puller's job is never done. Speaking of plumbing, I guess it's occupied. I think he's gonna be a while. Unless... We try out this brand new toilet water bowl. Mm, it's nice and fresh. Anyone thirsty? Quick, before a line starts. Cat cops? Ever seen criminal mice? You're welcome. Must be where they keep the best cat toys. I'm sure he'd be happy to lend a paw. Now fill it up with some hot glue. And scrape away all that sand. Only one way to see if it works. Great success! It was the perfect crime. Hey, it's dark in here! Ow! So hard to see. Is that a dog? Maybe the mystery box can help. Look, it's an LED collar. Try it out. And there's more where that came from. Now shine on. Is there any gold around here? Well, that answers that. Yeah, I wouldn't get too close. TP, maybe? Aha! A pooper scooper! Oh, it even comes with bags! Seems simple enough. Scoop it up. And put it where it belongs. You know, I always wondered about those pipes. And that's where gold coins come from. <laughs> hey, watch your step, Mario! I'd better think of something before you start seeing claws. Look, it's a dino chomper! Kitty want a lick? Aww, what a nice kitty. Maybe we should change the sign. This dog's bark is worse than his spikes. Stick to head pads. Hey, what's that? Ooh, let's pretend we don't see it. Aha! Oh, hey, that's not a mushroom. It's a pet massager. Try it out. Ooh, a hands-free experience. But that box is none the wiser. Oh no, the bricks are coming down. What the, is anything real in here? Let's hope this pomelo's a different story. Cause we could sure use that shell. Now for a little measuring. And a little cutting. Your pup's got a new helmet. Just in time, the sky is falling! Hey, this mushroom's a mess. 
Actually, the room's a mess. The perpetrator. Ah, don't worry. Here's something that can help. A cat brush. Seems self-explanatory. Grab that cat. And let's get brushing. And look, it even works on paws. Paws! When it's done, it comes clean off. Why don't we collect all this cat hair? Just get crafting, and soon we'll have a brand new pair of kitty flip-flops. Just the thing for a nice stroll. Or just a day of pampering. Now where is that mystery box? Uh-oh, looks like we've got company. Eh, let's try this one instead. It's an interactive treats wheel. Open it up and add the treats. Make sure you close it up. Now just attach it to the wall. You think he'll get it out? Great success! And while no dog's looking, this pug's a mess with stress. Cleaning him up is the easy part, but so is calming him down. With our helpful massage tool. Now for some tummy scratching. These little hands will get in every nook and cranny. And let's finish up with a face mask. Who needs a dryer? Sunshine's free. Of course, outside does have its drawbacks. It's okay. Take a basin and start welding. We need to cut out a little opening. Now add another basin on top. Decorate. And add something soft around the rim. Some litter is the final touch. And Kitty's got a brand new potty. To contain all those little surprises. What has this cat been eating? Good thing those aren't blocks. You should be nice to mushrooms. Or they won't share their coins. This will help a back scratcher. Um, I meant with the dog. <laughs> the dog! That's a good boy. Okay, lift a little more. And eh, we've got time. Keep on scratching. Hey, careful with those nails. Oh, your poor overalls. It's infuriating. Great, now the basketball's broken. Wait, we can use it for our next craft. Look, it's a piranha plant. It'll probably need a stem. Here, cover it up with rope. And maybe it can use a tongue. Now Kitty has a brand new scratching post. And a throne right on top. Check out this dog mobile. You've got insurance, right? No matter, we can fix it up. When life gives you lemons, 
Oh, we can just use this cart. Of course, a new ride should look its best. Don't forget to add some headlights. We're gonna need some engines. And an M for Mario. And streamers. Let's take it out for a spin. Oh, it's Mario powered. Guess we'll save a ton on gas. People save baby footprints. Why not do the same for your fur babies? And here comes the fun part. Breaking it all to pieces. Huh, this cat doesn't look like he belongs to anyone. So let's fix that. Make your shirt into a pouch. And bring him to your house. Which shall henceforth be his house. Cats usually clean themselves, but this looks like a big job. At least, skin's easier to clean than fur. This looks like a job for one of our gadgets! A cat brush. And when you're done, look how easy it is to remove the hair. Which also makes it easy to use in crafts. After all, cat hair's better as earmuffs than on your couch. While we're at it, let's do something about those nails. But why stop at just cleaning those nails? These clips fit right on. And think of all the money we'll save on polish. <laughs> wow, lipstick for paws. I would have just called it paw stick. <laughs> Good idea, a massager. You know, it's hard work being a cat. Yeah, he should feel nice and relaxed. Now how can we make this dinner table more cat-friendly? Maybe this cardboard box can help. After all, cats already prefer the box to whatever's inside. And you can do no wrong with some colored tape. Look at all these colors. It's like a rainbow of tape. Hmm. Ew. With this plastic bowl, we can make a window. If only it was this easy making a window into a bowl. Aww. What else can we add? Honestly, I'm not surprised lawns are free. With all that hassle of mowing them, some people might even pay you to take it. Ah. Hmm. Oh, some free clothes just lying around could be useful. Ah yes, jeans. Like your skirt, but with legs. Let's stuff it up with some of these other clothes. And tie the legs up together like a pretzel. Our project is almost done. Just add the roof. And a few finishing touches, like these sticky notes. Place them down in a pattern like roof shingles. Hmm, what else is nice and sticky? Great idea! A sticker! We can personalize our furry friend's new home away from home. Is there <laughs> anything else a cat would like? <gasps> hmm. Hmm? Ooh. These brushes will make fun self-groomers. What else do cats like? <gasps> Clothespins? Do cats like clothespins? Okay, I see where she's going with this. 
A fish mobile. Furnishing a house has never been so delicious. Oh, and what a lovely picture frame. Excuse us, we're just gonna borrow this, too. Wow, this mat fits inside the frame. What are the odds? And now we have a brand new scratching post. This flower pot has a lot of space. Cut it open, and it's a perfect private makeshift litter box. Oh, water. Cats need water too, right? Let's add a cat water fountain. Just add water. It looks like our fish mobile is getting nice and pungent. Do you have anything else we could add? These beads could add just the right touch. Let's just run some thread through them. This would make a great friendship bracelet. Wow! But now, tie up the excess string and cut. This way, it ends in a little pom-pom. Make different sizes for your new beaded <laughs> curtains. Next, let's cut up a hole in this stool. Add a plate right on top. And with the help of these silicone molds, we can fill it up with the best custom-made snacks. And just think of all these different flavors. Hmm. She's got that look in her eyes. She's got ideas Ooh. for this traffic cone. We'll need to cut up this plastic bottle and add hot glue. Add some around the rim to soften things up. Add to the cone. And fill it up with even more cat treats. <laughs> of course, what's a cat house without a ball of yarn? Except we're gonna use it for our next craft. I wonder if this girl's ever played Cat's Cradle. I feel like it'd be right up her alley. Oh, these plush toys would be great for that net we just made. Of course, you can't have much of a cat house without a cat. Let's see how he likes it. Does he love it or does he love it? A free hat? Well, these wonders never cease. He's having a lot of fun looking at stuff. And would you look at that? He's potty trained with an actual pot. Now to kick back with a nice snack. Some more snacks. The only thing better than having a cat is being a cat. Meow, amazing stuff. Catch you next time. Instant cats. Just add water. <laughs> and they say cats don't like water. <laughs> Let's just sneak on by. Aww. Nothing to see. Home free. Oh, coochie coo. <laughs> this is gonna be a great day. I jinxed it. Hmm. This bed could use a makeover anyway. Remove this wood. Add a panel to the side. Oh, anyone getting dizzy? A fresh coat of paint fixes up everything. All three walls. Let's see what we can do for the outside. A stencil pattern. Let's spread on some paint. Who says we need a brush? Besides, this is much faster. Peel off. On second thought, a brush can take care of the little details. 
Look, a cat face! As if you didn't guess who this was for. Hmm, this hole looks scratchy. And not the kind cats like. This cat door will help make an easy entrance. And with the help of these toothbrushes, the cats will get the scratches they like. Let's take a quick tour, shall we? This grass carpet will please the wild cat inside your pet. What else can we add? Hmm, an old pizza box? Cover with tape, and you can make a few steps. Steps right to the cat's own private bathroom. Meet the new and improved litter box. Now, what else do cats like? How about this? Take some rope and twist it around a base. Tie it so it's nice and tight. And your cat has a new scratching post. What else? Maybe they'll like that pigeon. Oh, even better. Take a desk drawer, add pillows, cushions and some toys, and it's a brand new bed. Here's something we can add to the wall. Now your cats have their own private television. Oh, it's getting hot in here. You know, the cats might want a drink. So, let's give them their own fountain. After all, it's easy to get hot when you can't take off your fur coat. Always smart to try things out before trying on the cats. Now that they have water, they might want something to nibble on too. And we're going all natural with cat grass. And there's plenty of room for a bowl full of cat chow. But let's keep the fridge stocked with wet food, just in case. Everything's really coming together. Let's add some more toys. Well, he's off to Wonderland. What's down there anyway? Ooh, candy. Oh, this bowl should fill up the hole. It's the perfect place for some cat toys. And if the cats are feeling a bit hungry at playtime, this toy's the perfect thing. Just add food. See, they'll get a treat when they spin it around. That'll keep them active. <laughs> hey, can we borrow this pillow? Now take some tights and cut them up. We need an X shape with some material in the middle. Tie each of the two opposite ends together. It's like a bed and swing all in one. Let's test it out. You know, these buttons can help get their point across. They can tell us when they want water, food, or even playtime. It's a bit too small to be a staircase. But we can still use the base. Attach to the wall, and we've got stairs after all. Hey, you're not using this giant bucket, are you? Thanks! Now that we've cleaned it out, we'll cut out an opening. Huh, what else do we need? How about more toys? You can never have enough cat toys. And we can use them for a project. Hot glue them to the patch from earlier. You remember from the hole? Add them to the bottom of our can for a soft cushion. Now break out the power tools. We're drilling some holes. After making a few, run some thread through them. It's kind of like a checkerboard pattern. The cats are going to be so happy. Where are they anyway? 
<laughs> I uh, think you've got a little something there. Oh, that gives me an idea. Add hot glue, press it down, and it's as good as laminated. Perfect for keychains or personalized collars. <laughs> this cat toy's interactive. Let's add it to our collection. <laughs> Cats sure have good taste. This looks fun. <laughs> cat food? Maybe we should leave some things to the cats. Oh, it's just a toy. Huh? And we've got the perfect place for it. You know, it's a little small. We need to think bigger. Let's get a large glass container filled with water. Filled with stones and marbles. Add a plant. And the finishing touch, these cute little fish. I spy with my little eye, well, her eye, eyes, a plastic bottle. Empty it and cut it up. Take the bottom and hot glue some string in the middle. Now use the string to reattach the two pieces. Add a pom-pom to the top and fill with cat chow. Hang it up. More snacks? These are gonna be some lucky cats. Cool, a laser for our cats to catch. Let's try it out. Either it's the laser or she needs to clean her pores. Hard to catch? Just what we need. What's on your head? It's like a fidget spinner. Let's add to the wall. What can't be improved with the addition of stickers? These pictures will help give it a more homey feel. Some more toys. Cats sure know how to live. Maybe we can put this tablecloth to better use. As the curtains for our brand new cat hangout. Yeah. This is where all the cool cats come to play. Great place for a nap. You gotta for a big day of sleeping. Still, look at all the fun stuff to do. Eat grass. Use stuffed animals as a floor. Or just relax. Looks like someone's ready to play too. Or maybe just stretch. You gotta love all the accommodations. And there's still so much more to explore. Who needs steps when you have a giant scratching post to climb? Unwind, watch a little TV, have a drink. Oh no, mm -hmm. he's found the cats. I mean, what cats? Huh? Oh, it's love at first sight. Meow, horrific stuff. Catch you next time. You know, this Cheetos can put some pep in your step. Just built a little boot around it. Add some paint, or even better, glitter chair. And you've got new lifts. Now get stepping. On second thought, watch your step. You got paw prints everywhere, don't worry. Enough caramel can cover up any blemish. Give it time to harden and you've got candy. Add a stick and it's a lollipop. Or should we say lollipop? Done with that bottle? Good, we can recycle it. Especially that cap. Add clay and a paper dog. This ain't construction paper, color them in.
the eyes. Let's go with googly. The gang's all here. Let's get rocking. They just keep going and going and going. Wow, a dog making dumplings. Eh, still better than mine. Don't worry, that's what our dumpling maker's for. All you need's the dough and filling and voila. You've got a perfectly wrapped dumpling. Wow. Careful, that might be the one with kibble. Ooh, a bone. Ooh, an even bigger bone. And ooh, a corgi? Kind of breaking the pattern. But at least he seems fun to play with. Give him a treat and watch what comes out. Ooh, careful where you're aiming that. Oh no, not the cheese puffs. I wouldn't eat that. Ew, someone get this dog a diaper. Wow, a candy machine. Looks like you've caught one. This game's a lot of fun for kids. But as for pups, not so much. But maybe then can join in on the fun. We can make our own candy machine. Just with kibble instead of candy. Press a button and the treats come pouring in. It's good thing his head fits in. Hmm, I guess someone ran out of candy. Oh no, Monica's missing. Oh, there she is. So, does this mean I get the reward? Guys, I'll get back to you. For now, let's get crafty. Next time she gets lost, she'll have an ID tag. We'll need her name and a contact number. It's kind of big. Let's shrink it down to size. Bake it in the over and bam, it's bite-sized. Just the right size to fit around her neck. <laughs> it's lunchtime. Guess someone doesn't want to share. I know, grab a pop tube and a funnel. And let the food come right to you. Use a bowl to keep everything in one place. Unless, of course, you want to eat off the floor. All done? Well, let's keep it around for dinner. I heard of dog groomers, but not like this. Oh no, you took off the whole eyebrow? It's okay, this toy has plenty of hair to share. He just keeps it in his blackheads. Good! It should be more than enough. But first, he really needs a shave. This is going to take a lot of shaving cream. Time for a rinse. And that's good enough. What a good boy. You've earned a treat. Ooh, a hot dog. The last food in the house. I probably shouldn't have mentioned that. It's simple solution. Just split it up. You get a piece and so do you. Hey, what about me? Mmm, pizza. Wait, watch out. Oh no. Is the pizza okay? We can rebuild it. Fry up the dough. Okay, this might take a while. Good. 
This face is nice and crispy. But a little makeup wouldn't hurt. No one wakes up looking their best. Take a bite. Just eat around the eyelashes. Oh no! Your wig! I told you to tape it down. Don't worry, we'll make you some new hair. Cut up something purple, like onions. Just as long as she looks like an anime character. Start by whipping them up into spirals. Anyone else starting to tear up? Just me? Let's lie her down and see if we have enough. But save some too. I want onion rings. That should be enough. Looking good. Wow. So where are we on those onion rings? <laughs> Oh, even the tiniest of hearts can be broken. But don't worry, we'll make you a new friend. Literally, just need a glove, a cup, and some markers. Give it a muzzle, and soon you've got a brand new dog. Tuck it inside. Add a hole and a straw and blow it up. She's ready. Time for a meet cute. Emphasis on cute. Wow, they really like hot dogs around here. The chase begins. Get back here. Okay, now I'm starting to get dizzy. Hey, don't give up. Get crafty. Or better yet, crafting. Draw a runner in one circle and their legs in another. Cut off the tip of a straw to connect them together. Now these paper dolls will do all the running for you. Add a background and it's like you're in a cartoon. So who won? Hey, let's call it a draw. Ooh, what's in that giant block shaped box? Oh, that little shirt's sure seen better days. We can spruce it up. Get out those felt tip markers. And I mean all of them, make a rainbow. Roll it up and add to water for a nice relaxing soak. Once it dries, help your furry friend become fashion forward. Careful with those paws. Don't you look cute? Well, cuter. And since you're all dressed up, let's dance. Shake that tail. Okay, almost done. Congratulations. This girl's going to be a cat person. Unfortunately, pets aren't allowed here. But when it comes to cats and cat ladies, love always finds a way. I won't tell dad if you won't. Wait till you see the best part. This cat already comes with kittens. Now let's clean you up with our very own cat tongue. Soon you'll do this for the kittens. Actually, I think both of them will. Ooh, someone needs a bath. Now let's put on your shower cap. Oh, right. Cats don't like water. Hmm. 
that's why we've got a special cleaning kit. Add a little foam and comb it into the fur. Now your cat smells brand new. It's time for a little redecorating. Careful, you don't want to lose such precious dirt. Let's sweep it all into a corner. Make sure to spread it out. Grab a rubber chicken or other garden tools. We're gonna plant some seeds. Don't forget to water. And pretty soon, you'll have your very own grass carpet. <laughs> now grab some cardboard and add them to the sides. Huh? Hmm. Now we'll need a bowl. An empty one. Use it to draw a circle and cut it out. Wow. And the bowl should fit right in. Let's make a bunch of these little windows. <laughs> hey, do we need to clean the cat again? No, it's coming from this old pizza box. Ditch the pizza, but let's keep the box. In fact, a bunch of these boxes will help us make a kitty bathroom. Complete with all the amenities. Think outside the litter box. Hey, I think she likes it. But first, it's petting time. Who's a good girl? If only we had some room to move. Here's an idea. Let's distract the cat. Grab a bunch of different pillows. And make yourself a decoy you. See, kitty? An even softer lap. And we're free to go explore. Yes. Just in time. I think I just heard something inside your closet. Eh? Uh -huh. wow. Ooh, the dolls are having a party. Complete with a little mini fridge. Wow. Now we can fill it up with all of our cat's favorite feasts. Well, when Dad's away, the cat will play. Okay, a typing cat is impressive. But Dad's not supposed to see you. So let's get you out of here. Still, if you like computers so much, we'll make one just for you. One that's also a scratching post. And it's so fun to sit on. Oh, hey, what you looking at? Ooh, birds. I wish we had our own bird. And now we do, a rainbow parrot. It can fly too. Eh, everyone's a critic. Well, at least we still like it. But you know what else is fun? A great big cardboard box. Thanks. Let's tear it apart and put it back together. But in a whole new way. Otherwise, it'd just be busy work. 
Don't forget to close up the back. It looks like a television set. Let's put on the mouse network. Talk about interactive television. But in life, cats are the stars. And we are just the spectators. Uh-oh! Dad needs new glasses. But let's hope he keeps them for now. Oh, and by the way, happy birthday! He's got a special surprise for you. It's a new cat! Well, a toy one. Because you don't have a real one. And to keep him thinking that, let's put this fur remover to good use. And he's none the wiser. Wait, where's the cat? Uh-oh, she's on the prowl. And she's on a feng shui kick. Hmm, let's get something that'll keep her distracted. Like this fun whack-a-mouse gadget. And the best part, no tokens required. Let's hope she washed her paws first. Quick, grab it! Or at least turn it over. As for Dad, who wants pizza? And how about we fill up all these paw prints? Give it time to dry and flip it over. And it fits right on your cat's collar. Gimme paw! It's the gift that keeps on giving. Next up, we're gonna need a sock. Now add to a glass container and fill with dirt. Add some seeds, cover with more dirt, and tie up that sock like peas in a pod. Let's add some cute little antennae. Spray on water, watch the plants grow, and give your cat a new treat. It wiggles, too. Wow, this place is really coming together. <laughs> it's where all the cool cats want to be. And what Dad doesn't know won't hurt him. Of course, even with all the fun stuff we've made, Sometimes, all you need is a place for a little cat nap. Careful, kitty! The cat catcher's on the prowl! Oh, won't someone save this cat? Don't worry, this girl's got your back. Now let's get you out of this net. And get you ready to see the vet. Okay, that doesn't look good. Maybe this'll help. Clear! Well, that didn't work. Wait, I think she's got an idea. It's time we unleash our secret weapon. Cat food. It just might do the trick. Hey, are you gonna finish that? 
Now that you're all better inside, let's fix you up on the outside, too. Our special glove will do the trick. It's time for some serious petting. Ooh, look what the cat dragged in. Let's clean those dirty paws. This soap dispenser should help. Or at least make things a lot more fun. <laughs> now it's time for a little brushing. But now let's put it into overdrive. And massage all your worries away. Honestly, pressure never felt so good. Oh no, your bracelet! What can we do with all these beads? Let's use them for a craft. Make a paw print. And place some beads inside. Keep it in place with some epoxy resin. When it dries, turn it over and dig. Kind of like looking for buried treasure. But our real treasure's right here. Mmm, snack time. Oh, looks like mom's back. How do you want to explain the cat? <laughs> or better yet, should we put this banana peel to better use? Nobody here except us bananas. <laughs> it's not the right time to introduce you two to each other. Ooh, I choose you, Pikachu. Hey, isn't he a mouse Pokemon? Uh-oh, but it's all right. We can fix him. Just add some parts to an old tube. Ooh, Pikachu's gotten taller. Now wrap some rope around the tube. And don't forget his other parts. He's like a brand new scratching post. And I think he's ready for a new play date. Aw, now play nice, you two. What do we have here? A wood wow. stick! Now let's add it to a wooden square. A nice hinge will keep it in place. <laughs> Gotta keep it nice and secure. But now, we're gonna add some layers. Mm -hmm. Like a nice midsection. And now for the top floor. Hmm, it's a little hard. Let's get something soft. <laughs> like a bunch of pillows. Oh, look, they fit right in. What else can we use? Ah, curtains. Now let's make some cuts. and tie it around the structure. Wow. Pretty soon, you've got a new canopy bed. Ah, oh, this cat tree looks like a lot of fun. Ah, please tell me that's just juice. Ew. Well, that sock's seen better days. Ew. Hmm. That yeah. mini toilet could be useful. Let's fill it up with kitty litter. And let our feline friend try it out. 
Well, I'll get the scoop. Ew. Hey, what's under here? Books! This'll come in handy as our new cat staircase. Of course, cats always land on their feet. Ooh, the cookies are burning. And while she's not looking, Luna's in the mood for chicken. Hmm, let's get you some lunch. Smear some food on this licking mat. That takes care of Kitty. So, who wants pizza? Oh no! That's your second favorite plant! Good catch! Here's an idea. Collect some old feathers. And add them to your shoes. Now you can keep an eye on Luna's playtime. It's time to start another day. Oh, can we borrow this towel? All we need is a little rope belt. Wow, everyone's so generous today. Add it inside. Make twists and turns. And you've got a tiny hammock. All that's left is to hang it up. Let's make one for the cat, too. Time for a well-deserved snack. Uh-oh, that's gonna leave a stain. I guess we could just cover it up. Looks like the cat got to it first. We could just do the laundry. But this fur remover should do the trick. Now it's as good as new. Uh-oh! Oh, what is it with this cat and plants? It's okay. Add a sock to a glass. Fill it up with seeds and soil. Water it and soon it'll grow. Wow, that was quick. Wow. Add some eyes. <laughs> and now it's your cat's new best friend. Or snack. Either way. This cat prefers food with a face. Aw, makes you wish you had a feline friend. Mm -hmm. Nothing a little scrolling can't fix. Uh-huh, I guess this doll's a fixer-upper. First, let's open up those eyes. And add some color. Look who's here! It's Hello Kitty! And Dolly what? wants to be like her. She's got just mm. the thing for those zits. Actually, she is just the thing for zits. Mm -hmm. And look, the gunk peels right off. Ooh. Now it's time for some foundation. Aww. This gadget should help. Cool. Add some makeup, and let's get the wheels turning. Ooh, make sure to get that lipstick smudge. Now for a face sponge. Wow, Kitty's really rubbing off on you, isn't she? No mouth? Well, say it with your eyes. Hmm. But if you do, pucker up. Oh. Oh. 
Now let's make a heart shape. And fill it up with your glue gun. Uh huh. Look, it's a cute little cat nose. It just needs a touch of pink. Now it's time we fix up that hair. We're gonna need some shaving Ooh. foam. And some ink from a marker. Hmm. Choose any color you like. Wow. Now let's mix it up. And add it to your hair. <laughs> It's time to heat things up. Crank up the blow dryer. And enjoy your new color. <laughs> but what's a cat without retractable nails? Just add a straw on each nail. <laughs> now take some soda. and inject it into your fake nail. It's like a lava lamp right at your fingertips. Cool. Make that 10. Aww. Aiming for 20? Hmm. No, wait. This sock can be a fluffy fingerless glove. But every cat paw needs some pads. Cool. Can't forget those toe beads, either. <gasps> now for some cat ears. Huh, wanna shave? Ew. After all, cats just love grooming. Add a wax strip and peel it off. You know, this fur could be put to better use. But Kitty's never fully dressed without a bow. Otherwise, she'd be Dear Daniel. Hey, what's that? Come back here. We got you. Hmm, this sponge could be just what our wardrobe needs. Of course, we might need a few more sponges. Did you sit on something? A pop tube. Cool. Hmm. Roll it up with something fuzzy. Maybe add some highlights at the end. And it's your brand new wow. tail. What a transformation! She's Hello Kitty. Uh -huh. Of course, we're gonna need a box wow. if we're aiming for collector's edition. Cool. Step inside. Hmm. Oh, and don't forget the logo. Uh huh. Now strike a pose. Hello, Mr. Strawberry. Are you ready for your facial? Ooh, it looks like a beard transplant. Well, he always wanted to be one of those cool shaven cans. <laughs> when it comes to peas, you don't need a whole pod. You can have tons of fun with just one. Hey, that rhymes. But what's really fun to play with is a balloon. Blow it up. You know, we can use it to make a pea pod, too. Let's start out by making three. Now tape them together. For extra fun, let's draw some faces on them. Hey, my faces are still faces. Now give it a good squeeze. Ooh. 
All the cats are coming out for this. What a pretty dolly. Let's give her a haircut. I was thinking a pixie cut, but bald is beautiful. Now let's trim some whiskers. Wait, hold on. We can whip you up a new weave. Be careful, you might feel a slight pinch. Ooh, who says blondes have more fun? Sometimes you just gotta think pink. Mm, cherry flavored. A plastic cup with nothing inside. What a waste of a good cup. So let's have some fun. Draw something on it. It's a tiny pair of shades. And look, they come in your size. Who says hole punches can only come hole shaped? Especially when you can get the gold star, among other prizes. Let's see how he looks with a few beauty marks. But why not save some for yourself, too? Enjoy your cat nap? Surprise! We've never looked better. And cats already look good, thanks to all that beauty sleep. As every cat knows, it's kind of hard to top a ball of yarn. But we're always up for a challenge. Let's add it inside a balloon. What else? Ooh, glitter. And some clear glue. Ooh, it's nice and squishy. What else can we try? Ooh, ice cream. It's got a nice smile, but let's give it a bigger mouth. Oh, it's nice and hollow. So let's squeeze our squishy ball inside. When it's ready, give it a good squeeze. Just because that one cat wore a hat doesn't mean they all do. All cats have their own sense of style. Some prefer to sparkle and shine. And also wear wigs. And don't you worry, there's plenty of sparkle to go around. Oh no! Cola is a terrible thing to waste! Careful, you don't want any sticky paws. Don't worry, just blow up a balloon. And deflate it into a brand new glove. You could just lap it up, but cats prefer milk. Hmm, you sure that bowl's big enough? Then again, you can't beat drinking straight from the source. We might not have the whole cow, so we'll settle for the others. Bubbles are so fleeting, so let's make a bunch. Here's an idea. Take a bottle and a straw. No, we're not blowing bubbles in chocolate milk. Especially since we're cutting them up. Place pieces of straw inside the bottle top. Use a rubber band to attach it to an electric fan. Now just give it a dip in some bubble solution. Time to turn on your DIY bubble machine. Ah, the artist at work. Let's add some red, yellow, blue. It's SpongeBob. I knew that cat had good taste. Time for Sponge to meet Squeegee. Gotta love that underwater work. 
Our little archaeologist is hard at work searching for treasure. Just add a little water, not too much. Now time to air dry. Time for some elbow grease. I think cats have elbows, right? A running mouse? Let's see if it lives up to its name. Oh, look at it go. No wonder it's so much fun chasing him. I'm starting to understand where the term cat burglar came from. Just what is our furry little friend up to? Ooh, a balloon. I guess he likes it on the frosty side. It's like a pinata. Just scratch it open and collect your prizes. Congratulations! Careful, you might chip a tooth. Oh, now where's that blow dryer? Oh, even better, a hammer. It's time for a little smashing. Make that a lot of smashing. Careful, you don't want to break your stuff. What a good idea. We've still got ice left over. After all, I am feeling a little parched. Time to do a little gardening. Look at that cucumber. Let's clean it up. Keep it lined up. We're gonna start slicing. Or would you prefer to pickle it first? We're only cutting partway through for now. Flip it over so we can cut the bottom half. Why not? Keeps the board scratch free. Careful, we're not cutting all the way through, you know. Because it's much more fun to make a spiral. Hey, squash can come in spaghetti. And why should squash have all the fun? Caterific stuff. Catch you next time. Aw, poor little rich girl. Yeah. Oh, yeah. no. What's going to happen to all her pets? I mean, think of the hamster. All these bristles should make paw cleaning a breeze. And look, it's electric. Just press the button and add water. Just in time, too. Look at those dirty paws. It's like a before and after. Let's fix that. Much better. Wow. But let's try out the homemade version. Ew. It's a cup, but what do we do for bristles? Good idea. Don't forget to add water. And by the looks of it, you'll need to power it yourself. It looks like it works just as well. You'll save quite a bit if you put in some elbow grease. Yes, it's playtime. Bring on the toys. It's like a carrot patch with hidden treasure. Never underestimate a puppy's sense of smell. I sense a pattern. Oh, look under the carrots. Now let's see if we can make our own fun. If you ever wanted to play tic-tac-toe with animals, now you know how. Wait, do you have to eat the treats too? Ah. 
And it looks like we have a winner. And he's such a good sport. Finally, something for the hamsters. Wow, this is like the easiest maze ever. You win, and the prize is hamster snacks. Maybe we can have some fun with this tube too. Ew. Soon we'll have our own little labyrinth. And we can add extensions too. Just keep on eating chips. Speaking of snacks, either way, he's happy with the end result. Next up is a little something special for the cat. Wow! This combines the fun of an avocado with the things cats go nuts for, catnip. This kitty's gonna sleep well tonight. Now, what can we do with this toilet paper roll? First, cut it up into four pieces. Fold them together into a sphere and add a treat inside. And once again, the game begins. Oh, it's not free. It's priceless. Which one will she choose? I would have picked the one for the hamster. Just think of all the leg room. Being carried around, it's the only way to travel. Now it's time to try this giant mm. tote bag. Yes, never underestimate the power of legroom. Just don't make the holes too big or Aww. she'll escape. Wow. And everyone can give your pupper a nice foot rub. Of course, pets need to stay hydrated when you carry them around. And with a few little twists and turns, it becomes a fountain. Maybe we can do the same by cutting it up. Like all our best crafts, it's time to add some fire. Stick in a bottle of water. Loosen the cap and let gravity do its job. Either way, the dogs like it. Scratching posts. Because, like the best of us, cats just know the importance of getting your nails done. Well, it's a good shape, but will it be good for scratching? This yarn should help. After all, it is yarn. And cats kind of have a thing for yarn. Let's just hot glue everything into place. And add a mustache. You know, just to keep things fancy. Good, those nails are getting quite a workout. With googly eyes and a hat, it's a pretty good deal. 
But grooming isn't entirely your pet's responsibility. Hmm. These bristles will help clean up your cat's coat. Just in time, too. Ew. With all that hair, we can make a new cat. Yuck. Told ya. Well, yeah. we've got the glove, but what about those bristles? Ah, yes, hot glue. Just remember to let it dry. Well, the cat liked it, but it didn't really do anything. The toy cat can keep this. Now your cat can spend hours trying to catch fish. So after teasing him like this, you owe him a nice tuna dinner. Let's see if we can make our own version of this. Besides just letting your cat near a fish tank. Of course, adding catnip sure helps. And now you've got a kitty original to hang on the wall. What a deal! Well, when it comes to your cat's litter box, it's usually for the best to splurge. Cats need their privacy after all. I wonder if they synchronized this in advance. Probably should talk to your vet about this. Ew. Yeah, let's not waste a perfectly good sock. Here's a better idea. Let's make our own private litter box. Cool. Just need to make a door in this shelf. And add litter to the bottom. Now a cat can walk in whenever they need to. Though seriously, I'd really ask your vet about your cat and produce. As always, our animal actors were real professionals. Though the human one really could have learned a thing or two from them. Animal amazing stuff, right? Catch you next time. Instant cats. Just add water. <laughs> and they say cats don't like water. <laughs> Let's just sneak on by. Aww. Nothing to see. Home free. Oh, coochie coo. <laughs> this is gonna be a great day. Oh, I jinxed it. Hmm. This bed could use a makeover anyway. Remove this wood. Add a panel to the side. Oh, anyone getting dizzy? A fresh coat of paint fixes up everything. All three walls. Let's see what we can do for the outside. A stencil pattern. Let's spread on some paint. Who says we need a brush? Besides, this is much faster. Peel off. On second thought, a brush can take care of the little details. Look, a cat face! As if you didn't guess who this was for. Hmm, this hole looks scratchy. And not the kind cats like. This cat door will help make an easy entrance. And with the help of these toothbrushes, the cats will get the scratches they like. Let's take a quick tour, shall we? 
This grass carpet will please the wildcat inside your pet. What else can we add? Hmm, an old pizza box? Cover with tape, and you can make a few steps. Steps right to the cat's own private bathroom. Meet the new and improved litter box. Now, what else do cats like? How about this? Take some rope and twist it around a base. Tie it so it's nice and tight. And your cat has a new scratching post. What else? Maybe they'll like that pigeon. Oh, even better. Take a desk drawer, add pillows, cushions and some toys, and it's a brand new bed. Here's something we can add to the wall. Now your cats have their own private television. Oh, it's getting hot in here. You know, the cats might want a drink. So, let's give them their own fountain. After all, it's easy to get hot when you can't take off your fur coat. Always smart to try things out before trying on the cats. Now that they have water, they might want something to nibble on, too. And we're going all natural with cat grass. And there's plenty of room for a bowl full of cat chow. But let's keep the fridge stocked with wet food, just in case. Everything's really coming together. Let's add some more toys. Well, he's off to Wonderland. What's down there anyway? Ooh, candy. Oh, this bowl should fill up the hole. It's the perfect place for some cat toys. And if the cats are feeling a bit hungry at playtime, this toy's the perfect thing. Just add food. See, they'll get a treat when they spin it around. That'll keep them active. Hey, can we borrow this pillow? Now take some tights and cut them up. We need an X shape with some material in the middle. Tie each of the two opposite ends together. It's like a bed and swing all in one. Let's test it out. You know, these buttons can help get their point across. They can tell us when they want water, food, or even playtime. It's a bit too small to be a staircase. But we can still use the base. Attached to the wall, and we've got stairs after all. Hey, you're not using this giant bucket, are you? <gasps> Thanks! Huh? Now that we've cleaned it out, we'll cut out an opening. Huh, what else do we need? How about more toys? You can never have enough cat toys. And we can use them for a project. Hot glue them to the patch from earlier. You remember from the hole? Add them to the bottom of our can for a soft cushion. Now break out the power tools. We're drilling some holes. After making a few, run some thread through them. It's kind of like a checkerboard pattern. The cats are gonna be so happy. Where are they anyway? I uh, think you've got a little something there. Oh, that gives me an idea. Add hot glue, press it down, and it's as good as laminated. Perfect for keychains or personalized collars. This cat toy's interactive. Let's add it to our collection. Cats sure have good taste. This looks fun. 
cat food? Maybe we should leave some things to the cats. Oh, it's just a toy. And we've got the perfect place for it. You know, it's a little small. We need to think bigger. Let's get a large glass container filled with water. Fill with stones and marbles. Add a plant. And the finishing touch, these cute little fish. <laughs> I spy with my little eye, well, her eye, eyes, a plastic bottle. Empty it and cut it up. Take the bottom and hot glue some string in the middle. Now use the string to reattach the two pieces. Add a pom-pom to the top and fill with cat chow. Hang it up. More snacks? These are gonna be some lucky cats. Cool, a laser for our cats to catch. Let's try it out. Either it's the laser or she needs to clean her pores. Hard to catch? Just what we need. What's on your head? It's like a fidget spinner. Let's add to the wall. What can't be improved with the addition of stickers? These pictures will help give it a more homey feel. Some more toys. Cats sure know how to live. Maybe we can put this tablecloth to better use. As the curtains for our brand new cat hangout. Yeah, this is where all the cool cats come to play. Great place for a nap. You gotta for a big day of sleeping. Still, look at all the fun stuff to do. Eat grass. Use stuffed animals as a floor. Or just relax. Looks like someone's ready to play too. Or maybe just stretch. You gotta love all the accommodations. And there's still so much more to explore. Who needs steps when you have a giant scratching post to climb? Unwind, watch a little TV, have a drink. Oh no, he's found the cats. I mean, what cats? Oh, it's love at first sight. meow horrific stuff. Catch you next time. Our mermaid's almost complete. Just a few more touches. Oh, she's alive, alive! And she's keeping the seashells. Maybe we should clean her up for now. Ew. Where's an early bird when you need one? Let's finish it off with a little pimple popping. Wow, now she's really come to life. Come on, let's see the world. Ooh, we uh, need to get you some legs. But first, let's have fun with this new face mold. Good thing we brought gypsum to the beach. Once it's dry, start digging and clean it off. It could use some color. Let's get painting. Could use some blush. And pretty soon, you'll have your very own beach boyfriend. <laughs> Seashells, don't leave home without them. They're great molds when you want to give your face a rest. Now just fill it up with clear glue. And add glitter. Don't be stingy. 
Now let's add a secret photo inside. This would make a great necklace. You can even make it a locket. Careful, looks like we've got company. And this shark just might be out looking for a bite. Well, if you want to keep your fins wet, get shoveling. Wow, our tide pool is really coming together. Of course, we're gonna need some water. But first, lay down a mat to keep the sand down. Now add the water. It's kind of important. And not just because we need it to live. What you waiting for? Try it out! What's inside this shell? Aw, oh, she's so cute! Careful! Uh-oh, can you reach it? I think she might be there for a while. Well, if she's stuck... The Orbeez will at least keep her comfortable. Give her a few new friends. And then pour on some resin. Soon we'll have our own little mermaid habitat. Did you play in the algae again? Without me? Well, a manicure will fix you up. Take a paper square and draw a shape. Draw it a second time with a 3D pen. Just don't forget to fill in the outline. Now, just make one for each finger. Hey, hold on! The ocean's calling! Ice cream's great on a hot day! Wait, no! Now I'm worried about that cotton candy! Ooh, it's a mermaid tail! This must be the scales! Apparently, she'll only eat things with a face. And next time, ask for just the cone. An old friend wants to say hi. Ouch! Here's an idea. Take a balloon and deflate it around your hand. Now you've got a pair of safety gloves. What a cute little rainbow worm! Watch it squirm! Wow. Oh no! Quick, before the tide comes in! Well, bottle caps can be fun too, I guess. Besides, if you add them all up on a string, you can make a brand new rainbow worm. And this one comes with googly eyes. And a squirming we will go. Both on the beach and in the air. And look who's back, too. Got any old plastic bottles? Cut it up. until it looks like pieces of sea glass. Add some wire and clear glue on the edges. Now add glitter. And for that extra sparkle, add some gems on top too. Fake is fine as long as they shine. Now they're your brand new ear fins.
Do you like water balloons? Try this. Fill a water bottle with seawater. Pour it into a balloon for a new stress ball. Just can't beat freshly squeezed. Pretty flippy stuff. Catch you next time. Hey, if I were you, I'd be careful with that pimple. Ew. I warned you. Now you're a mermaid. Hey, watch where you're swinging that tail. It's okay. She needed a makeover anyway. Any hair colors you want to try out? Great idea! Why not all of them? Chewy, too. Now, about that tail. Ooh, pink! Must be part snapper. And it scratches. She's no little mermaid. I think she wants a new look, too. Well, that's on brand. Make sure there's no fisherman around and put it on. You can use it to apply your makeup. Rainbow Fish wishes he had scales like this. Let's add some pearls. Fresh from the clams. So pretty. Time to brush that mane. Let's add colored hairspray. All of them. Blue, green, purple. The three classic cool colors. You look as cool as the ocean floor. Next up, we'll need some nano tape. It's the next best thing to sea glass. Add a fish, and it's your very own aquarium. Just don't forget to add the water. After all, you don't want your fish to get thirsty. But look, it's nice and squishy. Can't do this with a normal fish tank. Of course, you shouldn't squeeze too hard. Ooh, a bottle. Maybe it's got a genie who can help us. And we'll entice it with that sock. Wait, even better, it's our secret tie-dye tool! Dip it. Now blow it like a big conch shell. Now let the bubbles do the work for you. Scrub away for the big unveiling. Amazing. I think we deserve a treat. Gummy bears. Try the green one. Just add water and watch it grow. Look at it, it's huge! Which means there's plenty to go around. Take out a poppet toy and fill in the buttons. By the way, anyone notice the shape of that toy? Uh -huh. I'm starting to think there's something going around. Hmm. But that's no reason not to enjoy your new Technicolor Choker! Next up, let's whip up some kinetic sandcastles. But what's the fun in sand if you can't search for buried treasure? Oh, it's a little clam! With enough jewels to buy all seven seas! Or we can just use them for a manicure. Watch what happens when you give them a dip. Wow! Dirty dishes. Well, crying isn't gonna help. Or maybe I'm wrong. Look at those sponges. I guess crying really can solve your problems. Wow! Hmm. So let's put all that absorbance to work. Squeaky clean. Now let it dry. And let your sponge friends lie back. Phew. Oh, 
That egg has seen better days. Sponges, it's time for round two. Wow. Mermaids come from eggs? Well, they are part fish. Cool. Look, an empty container. Wow. Oh, are you making another fish tank? Or is this a sea monkey's sort of deal? Wait, I see. It's a mermaid snow globe. Now she can live forever in a winter wonderland. From Little Mermaid to Snow Queen. <laughs> Next up, grab a cardboard circle and punch some holes in. Now add some ties to give it some legs. Let's aim for eight in total, like spiders. But you might have noticed an underwater theme here. So if you prefer, you can say they're octopi. Either way, you can make them dance. Hey, buddy, looks like you found something. Wow. Oh, looks like temporary <laughs> tattoos. Wow, make that roll on glitter tattoos. Because you're always due for an upgrade. Hmm. A mermaid needs to know how to shine. After all, it does get dark a few fathoms below. Now it's time to blow up a balloon. Wrap it up with paper and add paint. And stickers, always room for stickers. Leave some room around the balloon's tail. Take some scissors and give it a good pop. How about we draw some scales too? Don't go all the way, we want room for a fish. Add eyes, a big pair of fish lips and fins. Why not make yourself a whole school? Aww. Oh, it looks like rain. <laughs> Grab your umbrella. Aww. Oh no, Aww. it's got a hole. Let's cover it up. Ooh, eyes. Why not add streamers too? Now you've got your very own jellyfish. Don't worry, we don't sting. And he'll make sure you don't get wet. <laughs> Wait a minute. Aren't mermaids supposed to like water? Wow. And speaking of water, what's in there? Chanel wires. Take some of your hair and twist them around. And give your locks a whole new look. Move over, Neptune. She's the queen of the sea. fish horrific stuff. Catch you next time. Who's up for a little breakfast on the beach? Wait, that's not breakfast. It's a stress ball. Aww. And it's so <laughs> stretchy. Let's see what's inside. Oh, this will come in handy for our new shoes here. Now add some soda and some candy for a foot bath that runs on fizz. Looks like you could use it. Let's take him for a spin. When nature calls, this place looks nice and secluded. Except for the snakes. But it's okay. We've got a stump. Add duct tape. Wrap it around and around. Add a handle. Grab some TP. And flip over your brand new potty. Now do your business in peace. Ooh, good call with that lid. Wow, it's hot. Let's press it up for a bit. Well, acupuncture can be relaxing. Ew. 
Try this. Uh -huh. Grab some overall straps and attach them to a bucket. Wear it like a makeshift tail. And you'll always have a place to sit. <laughs> this seems like a nice place to rest. The ants certainly seem to enjoy it. Hmm, that tree gives me an idea. First, come down and take off that top. Next, we're gonna need some shoelaces. Make some twists and ties on each end. And hang it up on that tree. Now sit back, relax, and enjoy your new hammock swing. Always keep an eye on what's around you. Never know when a wardrobe malfunction will strike. Good thing we've got a plastic bag to help. Rip it up and twist up some rosettes. Make a whole bouquet of these and pin them up all over your top. While we're at it, let's make a matching skirt too. Always time for some fun web videos. Oh, it's too bright out. Curse you, son. Wait, this cardboard box can help. Just cut out a little opening. Like so. Uh huh. <laughs> and add a phone on top of it. Otherwise, you'd be staring at the sun. Wow, word spreads fast around here. Let's get back to our nature walk. Wow, the mosquitoes sure are biting today. But we've come prepared. Mosquito repellent stickers. Perfect thing to cover those bites. It's like bug spray and a fashion statement all in one. And any gunk inside peels right off. Mother Nature sure is a hugger, and she always loves to share. Still, how about we wash that hair? All we need is some water. And our handy dandy shower head. First, let's make sure it works. Now give your hair a good rinse. Oh, if only we had a shampoo bush. Well, at least we can comb it out. Wake up, dear. You left the sun on. Oh, no. You're all sunburned. Your skin's practically shedding. But that'll be easy to fix with our handy lint roller. So let's get things rolling. Ah, much better. And next time, bring sunblock. Oh no, your fake eyelash! We're gonna need some shades. 
draw out a pear on a big plastic bottle and carve them out. Now place those eyelashes on top. They'll stay nice and secure. <laughs> and you'll always look your best. Dum -de -dum -de -dum -de -dum. Oh, that chocolate's not staying down. Into the woods we go. Hey, where's the keys? Looks like Dolly's got a new set of wheels. Yeah. We're not gonna see her again anytime soon. Toothpaste? Hmm. Well, at least we can keep our breath fresh. A doll head. Let's hope she's nicer than the last one. Well, if she likes toothpaste so much, she can be our new toothpaste dispenser. While we're stuck here, might as well have breakfast. Got any salt? Even better, ah. aluminum foil! Look at it turn this dowsing rod into a pan! Hmm. Now we need a fire. Got anything to burn? Oh, good idea! Money's not much help out here. So, how do you like your eggs? Scrambled? That should be enough. Let's eat! I'd keep an eye on your shoes. Hey, hasn't she caused enough trouble? Oh no! Your laces! What are we gonna do? Well, you've got all that hair. Maybe we can put it to good use. Cool! Now they're the perfect laces. So, did she bring the car back? I've heard of raining pennies from heaven, but hey, free cereal! Wait, that's not milk, it's a medical glove! Well, why pay for milk when you can get the whole udder? What are you waiting for? Time to get milking! Make sure you aim for that bowl. Eat it before it gets all soggy. Unless you like it like that. <laughs> this bark has lost its bite. Just don't forget the leaves. Ew. When there's bees, there's honey. Or money. <laughs> oh, now it's all wet. What are we gonna do? Tights? Who knew undergarments were so handy? Just wrap those tight around a stick. Time to go fishing with your new net. Yeah, I wouldn't smell that if I were you. What the? Ew. Anyone in the mood for fried seagull? Let's try to fix that hair. You might need more laces. With this device, you get a comb and a rinse all at once. Now just give it time to dry. What else can it do? Good idea. Your leg hair could use a good wash too. Hmm, something strange about these mushrooms. Popsicle sticks. Hmm. Add a few bottle caps. Maybe some wire and the rest of the bottle. And you've got a makeshift Whoa. fan. Wow. Ah, oh. uh, time to relax. But rocks don't really make great beds. A trash bag? Yes, we'll throw out the giant rocks. Or better yet, fill with air and add to your coat. Make a bunch and cover yourself up. 
It's like an air mattress. Let's try lying down. Aww. Careful. Next time, try to fall on your back. Help should be arriving soon. Okay then. Wow. An orange. We're saved. Just cut it up. Scoop it out. Keep the peel and poke some holes. Now it's hmm. just what we need to brew some tea. Pour some hot water and it's the perfect infuser. You might even get a nice hint of citrus. Hmm. Dip your biscuit and enjoy. A little makeover can help lift your spirits. Unfortunately, I don't think that makeup's waterproof. Hmm, maybe these coat hangers can help. Just tape them up to an umbrella. Give the hangers a good stretch. And you can wear it like a backpack. Go out in the rain and keep your hands free. We've been wandering for so long. At least a whole hour. Oh, is it? Yes! Civilization! We're saved! Saved! Oh, look who's back. Does she want to apologize? Even better, the keys! We can finally return indoors! Either there's no hard feelings, or Dolly wants a chauffeur. This video is brought to you by The Great Outdoors. Much like the great indoors, but without air conditioning. Or Wi-Fi. Okay, I guess they're not so much alike after all. Outdoor-erific stuff. Catch you next time.